Hey guys, Cindy out here with my Artsy Endeavors. Don't mind what you're seeing. This is one of my closets full of stuff, which we'll go through that later. Um, what I'm here to talk to you about today is drying. Now what I did, um, in my room I really don't have a lot of space to put up like a drying rack. So this is what I did. See that round silver thing right there? Well this has a, a uh, cord that comes out of it and see this other end? What you do is you take this other end, put it into its hook. Let me see if I can show you guys without this stuff being in the way. Put it right into that hook right there. And I instantly have a drying line. Now, if you notice what I use, I use regular old clothespins. Okay, these are ones that my granddaughter and I um, decorated a long time ago and all I have to do is come over here put something on it clip it and I'm ready to go so this is a short and sweet and simple video but um, the whole purpose of this is this is how I dry things when I do a crazy uh, jelly print session or something of that nature um, I bring them over here I put them up on my clothespins and there we go. So if you think you can do this idea, this uh, is actually a, a, re a retractable laundry line. And I found it on Amazon. I think it was like 10 bucks. Nothing crazy. Um, so if you have somewhere in your room, even if it's wall to wall, just check your space on how far it'll go. This one, I'm not sure. Um, but if you, let's say you have any two, a, a doorway. Okay, put one on one side, one on the other. Now, the greatest thing about this is this is actually, this part of it is actually, where am I, right here, retractable. So if I unhook it, which I had unhooked before, and then I unlock this here, let me see if I can show you. Sorry, unlock that right there, this will go right back in. And then it's gone. And then all I have to do is pull it out to get it going again. I'm sorry, I have chimes right here that usually hang on that. Shh. Sorry guys. Just so you know what you're hearing, those are my chimes. So if you don't wanna have that cord all the time hung up, then just take it and retract that line, okay? You'll have to do something with your clothespins, find a pretty box or something to put them in. But um, yeah, this is really convenient. Um, another thing you can do is, if you have grandkids, grab some clothespins, some scraps, some little, I don't know, bling, and have them do a um, clothespin decorating day. My granddaughter absolutely loved this. She had a blast. She's like, Grandma, we need to do that again. Well, now I wish she was down here because I do need it done again. But... There you go, there is my drying rack. Let me see if I can show it to you. It is quite large. Um, so it basically goes from here all the way over to there. All right, and that's plenty of room. So I hope you guys, you know, this gives you some ideas. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. And don't forget to have fun. That's what life's all about. Happy creating, guys. I'll see you next time. Bye.